something inside of me. I just didn't care anymore. <laughs> oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. Am I dead? Hey, 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 hey. This song fucking sucks. I'm not gonna lie. This video is brought to you by Sebastian's Patreon. <laughs> hey, sorry, not sorry to bother you, but I have something very, very important to tell you. As you know, I have a Patreon, and now it's being upgraded, per se. It's thick now, like Wano thick. There are now three tiers. I'll put the descriptions of all the tiers on the screen. Pause if you would like to read it. It's time to lock in, and by lock in, I mean every week we'll have a post. I'm just saying, if I was you, I would definitely go over to the Patreon and check it out because I'm giving back. So, yeah. If you would like to support the channel and the community, head over to my Patreon and tell me how you like it. Thank you for everything. Now, let's get back to the video. All right, so um, I kind of lied in my thumbnail. I'm not wearing this shirt. I put on a hoodie because it's cold as fuck. And I like to live in the cold because I like to live like Jack Frost. I hope you guys don't mind. And um, I'm not gonna lie, that intro was not planned. Today's album we're listening to is TXT Freeze. <laughs> They say that this is their best album. And, you know, judging by the track list, the only songs that I, like, know I know are Anti-Romantic, Love Song, and Frost. I, like, vid like I can tell, like, off the, you know what I'm saying? The, uh, just, like, off, off name, I know those three songs. If we got, like, six other than bitches, oh, five other than bitches, they're that crazy. I don't know. I'm ready to get into it. Ain't nothing to really talk about it. TXT is also finna come back. Well, they're coming back with a new concept, teaser and everything. I'm not watching the other teaser. I'ma just wait till the song or the, the actual, you know, the thing comes out because I just want to enjoy this in privacy for a second. But, you know, to commemorate TXT, bringing their asses out of hiding, technically, we're listening to TXT. The chaos chapter freeze. So let's get into it. That is note says the boy band shift between alt rock, angst, and synth pop dreams. I don't know what the hell that means, but all I know is this shit about to be fire, cuz you know what I'm saying? Oh, yeah. And uh just so y'all know, full reaction is on the Patreon. Edit reaction is on YouTube. If you want to see the full reaction, go ahead and go to Patreon. That bitch about to probably be like 40, 50 minutes, maybe. I don't know. But all I know is we finna get straight into it. We finna get down and dirty with this hoe. TXT's a part of Republic Records. <sighs> is it me? Or does like their vocals... It's like storytelling. Like, you could tell by either the way they come onto tracks or, oop, my forehead is exposed. I mean, like, the way that they come onto tracks, it sounds like they're about to tell the most firest of stories. You know what I'm saying? Cut it. Oh! Sorry, I'm an anti romantic. Oh! Tired of there's, a, there's, there's like a bunch of songs that will turn me into a rag doll or a ventriloquist object, a puppet. I ain't want to say puppet because that's kind of, um, that could be derogatory, but it, it just, it, these are one of the songs. What is that? What is that instrument? Is that a cello? That from, 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 is that what a cello is? It's one of them string instruments. I know it's a string instrument. Is that a cello or is that like a, or, or is that a bass cello? I don't know. There goes that. Sorry, I'm an anti-romantic. There's that goddamn vibe. Why do they keep doing that? They be, they, they keep forcing themselves a, a quick horse beginning of a, I don't know, of a line, bro. The, sorry, I'm in, sorry, I'm, ah. Oh. I definitely, I definitely listen to TXT for like experimental stuff. Like, cause in terms of layering, I want to call this anti-layering because like it's not, the way they the way they um structure their songs it's not it it's not normal 
It's not normal at all. Like, they'll either, like, if it sounds cohesive, they'll either throw some shit in there that doesn't even, you wouldn't even think, like, this belongs? What the fuck? All right, fuck it. Don't. Like, that's what they be doing. They, they, they stay, they stay doing that. They stay doing that. I ain't got nothing bad to say about this song. I would say this song is just, like, one of those dreams that's, like, kind of good, but it's also weird. It's, like, a, an extension, like, it's an abstract dream. Like, you don't even know if it's a nightmare but like it could be oh this could be like the dream leading to a nightmare i don't know bro i don't know but this is a good this is actually a good start which version is this is this like the boy version or the, the other version because i know there's like there's like three versions to this album damn god damn this this song is heavily produced why is that wait why did Damn, wait, why the vocals sound so metallic? What the fuck? Like, it's very, like, atmospheric. Boy, I don't give a fuck if it sounds metallic, nigga. This shit made me beat on my chest like a monkey, boy. And that's not good for me to say, but I could say it because I'm... The first time I heard the song, I didn't want to like be wrong, but it kind of sounds like they have like a little bit of Afrobeat influence in here. Like the um boom uh 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 ah like did y'all do y'all hear it? Please tell me y'all hear it. Please tell me y'all hear it. Please tell me y'all hear it. You bitch ass niggas is never y'all not gonna get me to cry. This song has has like a great ass foundation. Like in the back, it's the ah uh, ah uh, ah uh, ah. Uh. Like as much this see this is a very cohesive song. This brings out the teenage love interest out of me. This 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 reminds me of when I got my heart broken into tiny million little million pieces and shit. That's probably why I almost cried. But at the same time, this song kept me together. Like how do i explain this the 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 backing vocals held me together while i was getting broken into a tiny million a million a million million pieces and i'm it's, it's simulated the tiny million 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 pieces that i'm finna get broken into i appreciate that txc i've heard this chorus and that's it that's all i've heard Okay. Y'all see what I'm saying? Like, they be putting shit in that's not supposed to be in there. Like, what the fuck is that? What is that? Like, what the fuck is that? But it sounds so good. But at the same time, bitch, what the fuck is that? Used to be so afraid. Afraid of all the games we play. This is also, like, heavily produced. See, this is why I love these headphones. These headphones make me hear everything except for everything outside of the headphones. And, um... I'm not gonna lie, I like this. Something in me just changed. Why did that just remind me of that fucking meme? There's like something inside of me. I just didn't care anymore. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, I don't I don't like this part. Fuck it. Oh. oh I just I just know the video for this is insane. I just know that is there is there a dance break to this? There has to be a dance break to this. There has to be is there a dance break to this? Somebody please tell me. Somebody please tell me. Everybody clap your hands at your body broken out. Cause start talking and you just be like, bruh, what are you doing? Oh, it's like ice cream. Maybe it's the I don't know. Maybe it's the just the vision. Why oh. God, why the fuck? What what are these effects? Oh my Christ. Okay, I don't like this. I just noticed it. Yeah. 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 This song fucking sucks. I'm not gonna lie. I feel like I'm riding on a party bus or like a school bus or something. 
Like, this is like, I like, you know, I do like when TXT gets a little sitcom -y or like, it sounds like the songs that they make sound like it could be a part of a, a like a, like a score of a kid's show. I don't know why I love that so much. It's, it, it gives me like nostalgia. And the fact that they do like live up to this young, young, young nigga shit. I like it. I re I really like it. I don't know why. But I feel like I should just be eating a ham and cheese sandwich right now. This re this uh, this reminds me of coming home from school, my grandmama putting some bologna on the pan, frying it a little bit, put some cheddar cheese on that bitch, and on top of some honey wheat, nature's something. I forgot what it was. I forgot what the bread brand is, but it's like nature nature's own nature's own honey wheat bread and i'm eating that bitch with some berry punch minimate nigga this shit got me some mm. and some of these songs seem like they're they're just giving these songs just for them to like go through the motions i don't know how i can feel that but yeah Hold on, bitch. Hold on. Wait a, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Why you just gonna just throw me into the wood? Why you gonna throw me into the woods like that? Why you gonna throw me into the woods like that? Hold on. You just go by me just start moving my shoulders without being consented to that shit. That's not legal, bitch. What are you doing? Okay. Give me like five seconds to get myself prepared. Five, four, three, two, one. Okay, let's go. Come on. Uh, who was that singing at the beginning of the song? It sounded like Mark. What the fuck? These niggas are weird. I love this. Oh my God, yes. Why do I feel like I'm being dragged? Like somebody's grabbing me, like TXT is grabbing me by my wrist right now and just dragging me through hella multiverses. Like I feel like I'm that girl in Doctor Strange. If y'all ever see, have y'all seen Doctor Strange or whatever the fuck of madness? Yeah, I feel like I'm getting dragged through hella like multiverses. And like, I don't have time to process what the hell is going on. But I'm having a fun ass time. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> oh, that was a good time. That was a good time. Right, let me introduce these motherfucking songs first. See, they, they're like grabbing me by my wrist and dragging me through shit. I know. What the fuck? What is going? What is y'all? Oh! I'm about to get dropped off a cliff. I got my parachute. Come on, do it, do it, bitch. I I was okay. Wait a minute. Wait a damn minute because I was preparing to get dropped off a cliff. There's more cliff. I still haven't been dropped yet. What the fuck? <laughs> Wait, am I going to heaven? What is happening? Why, why am I not falling? Am I dead? They still didn't drop me. What the? <laughs> 10, get off of me. 10, 10, 10, get off of me. Get off of me. I'm about to go crazy. I'm about to go crazy. I'm about to get naked. I'm about to go crazy. Oh my God. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Alright, let's go. Let's do it. What? It's not loud enough. Oh, I turned it off. No, turn the shit up. Bro, I drive fast as fuck to this song. I'm not even gonna hold you. I'm not even. I'm not even gonna hold you. I break the law to this song. I'm not gonna hold you. I do felonies to this song. I'm not gonna hold you. <laughs> oh shit, my head. That shit was all right. You can go down. That that shit was alright. That shit was alright, cuz I'm not gonna lie. Oh my god. Wait, no, everything that just led up to that one song is negated. I'm sweating. Whew. As y'all can see, I really like that song. Oh god. Whew.
shit. I feel like I just got a workout. I mean, okay, so, all right. This TXT album to me, it feels like this, I don't know if this is this album or what, but this is definitely not their best body of work. I don't really know what to think, to be honest, but this is, this is, this is, uh, this is like solid, but like, uh, I don't really, I don't really, like, to be honest, I don't really know what to think of it. Like, it's okay. Well, not, it's more than okay, but it didn't really like hit me. I was more or less like confused more because I was trying to understand like, what the fuck are they doing in this shit? You know what I'm saying? But this was a pretty good time. I feel like I was just being dragged through a multiverse and um, there was some hits. Well, there was mostly hits. There was a couple misses. Actually, fuck it. I had a good time. I had a pretty, I had a pretty, I had a pretty good time. A pretty, pretty, pretty good time. And honestly, I can't wait for what they got to come. You know what I'm saying? Um, Minnesota is still definitely my favorite body of work. That, that, to me, that's their best. That's their best, like, their best shit. And that was an EP. But anyway, hey, man, I'm, I'm not going to, hey, listen, that was, hey, that was Freeze. I'm getting hot as shit right now, so there's that. But, you know what I'm saying? Hey, it was a good time. What do y'all think about this album? Is this their best body work? If it is, please let me know in the comments down below. If not, let me know in the comments down below. You know what I'm saying? This was pretty good. Frost really did that shit to me. I'm not going <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, cuz. But hey, if y'all enjoy, please leave a like down below. Subscribe if you're new and turn on your post notifications and tell your friends about me. This is a long video. <laughs> I'm sorry. But thank y'all for watching. Thank y'all for everything. I will see you guys in the next one. Y'all be easy, all right? I'm about to go dance to Frost again. I'm not going to lie. That shit was fire. Fuck. Bye. <laughs>